you surrounded by men all the time, which must have been a little bit of a strange experience for you. You um, had to supply all the estrogen on the set, you know? Right. Although they, it was, Mark Ruffalo was there to help. <laughs> Speaking of beautiful, you are beautiful. You look fantastic. You just had a child, I and I don't know how, uh, because... Uh, <laughs> I know how. Yeah. I'll talk to you about it yeah. later. If you want. Because there's like four of us left. <laughs> there's four redheads left in the universe. We are a dying breed. And then you decided to give up Team Redhead and go blonde. Didn't you feel this sudden loss of like sexual power? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I did. I, um... I, I was really happy to be working. I never thought I would be working in that, you know, condition. Well, were you, were you but, that big? Well, it doesn't seem I like it when big. we just saw you I on was, the I was, I was pretty big, yeah. How do they hide that? Um, it just magically went away. <laughs> What's Black Widow going to think of Guardians of the Galaxy, you know, and I just thought it reminded me of like all the aliens like just descending upon New York. And I think after that happened, like the last time everyone assembled, she was like, okay, I've seen it all. Like, I don't even think she's phased by a talking tree at this point, so. I... Caesar Merlin. C <laughs> you know, it's Cesar, isn't it? <laughs> Isn't it Cesar? It is Cesar Milan. Yeah, yes. I guess if you're, yeah, I if guess you're if you're... saying it right. Well. I would say probably Wally. It's an amazing love story. Wally and Eva. Oh, when his lights go out and oh my God, and he gets rebooted. I just like about died, but he comes back. It makes me cry just thinking about it. And then he just makes me cry. I'm also really hormonal, so you know, probably crying anything.